It is Saturday. I'm not right. <laughs> it's Saturday and we're supposed to be going to Savannah. Um, let me see. Huh? Give me that please. Thank you. Yeah, so we're supposed to be going to Savannah with Sonia because she texted me last night and said that Leopold ice cream, they're having their 100 year birthday. And so they're going to have like little events and activities and stuff going on in Savannah. So we're going to head out there. We're supposed to have been leaving at noon, but as you can see, it is 11, what time is that? Really? Oh, wrong, wrong button. It is 11.49. I'm still laying here because I told her we're going to push the time to 12 because, thank you, <laughs> because Amia is supposed to be taking a nap because I didn't want her to act crazy when we go out there and I get migraines and I just had a migraine uh, and now okay let me see now lay down that's why I told you and my migraine isn't even close to gone that just killed me a little inside but yeah so I took etc in like 30 minutes ago so it's kind of winding down but yeah hopefully by the time we leave around one o'clock it's gone and like it's kind of getting worse because Amia just bashed my head with her big head oh my god but we'll see if I make it out of this bed today because now I'm dying oh my god hi I made it out of bed and um, Amia is playing with my face brush. Excuse these little plots that I have, but I'm getting ready now. It is actually 12.50. It's 12.50, so I'm definitely going to be late. But I'm, a, I'm just about to get ready real quick. And we're going to head out the door. I'm telling y'all, like early. You saw when Mia like bashed my head in with her giant noggin. I tried to like turn off the lights and close my eyes and like try to like just relax because my head I was dying but I'm good now so now I'm about to put on my makeup fix my hair put on my clothes head out the door because I'm super excited about this um this little hundredth birthday of LaPaul I don't know how to pronounce it but I'll pronounce it right eventually in this video noodles and bar or something like that which was pretty nice she got to finish her mojito yes. I'm afraid I might get drunk but we're heading to Leo Leopold's the Leopold's 100th birthday celebration which it looks like is a pretty big deal it looks like a lot of people know about I'm this. telling you we gotta look into this place so we can go tour it. Marshall House is supposed, supposed to, be, to be haunted. One yeah. of the most haunted places. So this place is supposed to be haunted over here. We should come at night. Is it a hotel? Uh, or like just a shop? No. So we're about to go and get some ice cream. Some some discounted ice cream. And then probably going to get some food. Because the kids, we, mm -hmm. still have not eaten. Yeah. Autumn. Autumn, are you ready to eat some ice cream? <laughs> oh.
is hot. This was the worst day for makeup. It's hot. <laughs> Is Autumn still in line? What is she doing? She's trying to get her face painted. Sister? Yeah. <laughs> She's coming. So yeah, I guess we're just not gonna have ice cream. We're gonna stand in the direct sunlight and watch Mia play with bubbles. Mia! 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 this butter pecan ice cream I got Mia vanilla and what'd you get chocolate pecan chocolate pecan oh, I don't what ice cream did you get butter pecan, butter pecan. Darian what ice cream did you get let me see you said chocolate all chocolate oh, you die. yeah this you would die Paul's celebration and it was actually pretty fun they have a lot of stuff going on out there and cheap ice cream yeah so it was fun the ice cream was good now we are at the cotton tavern um, or the cotton exchange what exactly is this place called the cotton exchange we are now at the cotton exchange and I'm about to get this burger that I've been talking about for months now since the first time I came here because it was so good what are you getting back fried shrimp like Maybe Autumn took yours. She oh. took yours. Oh. Oh. I think maybe they thought I was young. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm gonna do. I think that's the burger, however. I think I got it medium rare or something like that. I want pink in the middle of my burger. Appetizers are here. We got calamari, some fried green tomatoes. The kids' food already came out. Darion had shrimp that he's not he's done with, and some fries. And Mia got a hot dog and some fries that she's really not trying to eat. And we're just waiting for our food. But this is good so far. <laughs> I never had a fried green tomato, so that's good. Yeah. Oh, that's spicy. What do you want? <laughs> yeah, see, I feel there it was a little spicy. Yeah. Only got a little bit, though. Good? It's pretty good. I have no clue. I just want to try it. It tastes harder, sauciest, sausiest. Where am I trying to use? Pretty good. Not bad. Wait, so what'd you get? What Cajun is that? Cajun tortellini. It's so good. Cajun tortellini. I got the Congress burger. What'd you get? I got a smokehouse burger. A smokehouse burger. That really looks so good. It is really I want to try it. Right? Yes, it's really I do. Good. I don't even like tortellini, but it's so easy. Yeah. That is so it's, Adam, that's so good. Like it's so good. good. Honey,
just saying how it's nice to always have something to do. Like you don't always have to go to a club. Like all those live bands over there. Oh, you have all those live bands, stores, food. So it's nice. It's fun. There's always something to do in Savannah. I'm telling you. Hey guys, it's actually the next day, but I was looking back at the footage and I noticed I did not talk much during the vlogging. I was just catching shots here and there of the things that we were doing. So I was just gonna go talk a little bit about what we did yesterday. First, I met up with Sonia at Co. It's a place, it's a sushi noodle bar. I think that's what it is. That's definitely a place I'm going to be going back to because it the menu looks pretty good and I just like the whole vibe of the place. After that we left Co and we headed over to the Leopold's 100th, 100th birthday celebration and we got some ice cream. The kids played around in the sun. It was really hot though. I'm telling y'all my poor child my son was miserable. Mia was having the time of her life but my son was just miserable he dressed himself that's my fault that's my bad because i should have checked the weather i've been here long enough i know for a fact that it gets super super high here in south georgia so i'm like you know what that's my bad after that we went to the restaurant we went to the cotton exchange i love that place if you want to know where you want to eat in savannah definitely go there i'm telling you it's like every single thing that i've tasted from there tastes amazing so you know i try to go there every chance i get it was kind of frustrating because i get migraines and i've been getting migraines for a while now earlier in a vlog as you saw mia tried to assassinate me i had a migraine she bumped my head made it a little worse but good thing my medicine started to kick in and i was good after that when i got to savannah my headache started coming back and it was kind of irritating because my medication usually lasts longer than that so when we got to the restaurant I couldn't really like interact with my friend and my sister and my kids the way I wanted to because my head was just killing me. I make sure I always carry etc. And I also carry another migraine medication that was prescribed to me but I left it in a car and I didn't have anything. I actually had to ask one of the ladies. I just went up to her and I'm like, listen, I know this may sound crazy, but do anybody that work here get migraines or headaches? Because I'm getting one and I'm dying and I need something. And she's like, oh yeah, yeah, I have, I get tension headaches. So um, you can try the medication that I have. Yeah, okay, it's unsafe to take medication from other people but I'm telling you like when desperate times cause for desperate measures you literally do anything but after that I take the medication and my headache started to go away we were able to go over to birds cookie store I think that's what it's called the cookie store that I've been dying to go to that I've been looking for because they have these little chocolate chip cookies that I love and I first tasted them when I got them from Savannah river street sweets or something like that but i could not find them and then somebody told me that they actually had a store and i'm like yes and i've been looking for it ever since and i finally found it so we went and we bought a bunch of cookies it was really fun the people in there were super funny too so you know that was nice then um what did we go after that oh we went to congress street like that little courtyard area kind of with the little um splat the, the fountain or something like that so we went over there and we let the kids play for a little bit and we actually sat there for a while and we were just talking and playing with the kids and stuff like that it was really fun um we ended up buying the kids these little light up things that all the other kids had they were like slinging them in the air so they were having fun. Once everybody started leaving, you know, we started to head out. All in all, we had a we had a really good time. I had fun, but yeah, I just wanted to add a little bit more commentary to this vlog because like I said, I completely neglected talking at all in this vlog. So, yeah. I'm gonna see you guys later. I'm about to go ahead and try to finish editing this video because it's honestly the reason why I stopped um why I came on to do this because I was editing and I'm just like mm, I didn't say enough but 
yeah i've rambled on long enough i'll see you guys later bye for the record i'm done trying to make y'all comfortable for the record you ain't trying to grow that stuff for you for the record lab on me going all the way for the record ain't trying to link no time to waste for the record for the record